In this beginner's guide, I'll show you how to put your existing main Eero or new Eero router into pairing mode or setup mode so that you can add them to your Eero Wi-Fi system. If you are trying to set up an Eero for the first time and if it's your only Eero, then for first time setup users, you just need to connect your Eero to a modem or a router and then turn everything on, then your Eero will boot up into pairing mode on its own which is indicated by the blue blinking LED. But in case, if it's a secondary Eero that you want to add to your Eero setup, then to put the secondary Eero to your Wi-Fi system, all you need to do is plug the power cord of your Eero into a power outlet and it will be in the setup mode from the get-go. So you can just open the Eero app and it will be discoverable. Lastly, if your Eero device is already set up and maybe it's malfunctioning, so you want to put it in pairing mode once again, then the easiest way to do it is by resetting your Eero device. For that, just look at your Eero's back and you'll see a button with a circle on it. This is the reset button and you'll need to hold down the reset button for at least 15 seconds. And while holding it, you can look at the LED and you'll see it will go orange and after blinking for a few times, it will turn red. This means your Eero is now reset. Then wait for a few more seconds and your Eero will soon display the blue blinking LED. So now your Eero is in pairing mode. And that's how you put your Eero into pairing mode. Now it will be discoverable by the Eero app. So now you can go ahead and set up your Eero. And that's all there is to it. If you found this helpful, make sure to drop a like and subscribe for more.